Hello and welcome to Law of Money with me, Vivek Law. Today we are going to put the spotlight on tax. It's an issue which scares all of us and it's an issue which is topmost on our mind. How do I save tax? Joining me over the next few weeks is Kuldeep Kumar, who is the partner and personal tax lead at PwC India. For a lot of young people who probably are not yet in the tax bracket, do you think it makes sense to in any case apply for a PAN? Because today you see a lot of expenditures uh, that you do, um, you know, demand that you quote your PAN. So even if you are not in a tax bracket or you've never filed your return or need to file a return, can you get a PAN? Oh, absolutely, you can get a PAN. I mean, uh, I, to do certain transaction, as you said, if you are buying a house or a mm. uh, house property you want to invest, even if you are working, your employer will ask for a PAN. Mm. So even if you are presently you are having your income below taxable threshold, uh, you should apply for a tax registration number. Mm. And you see the whole way the uh, the government is moving towards attacking the black money or the other what transparency they want to uh, create in the system. So whatever investment you make, those will get with linked with your PAN or with your uh, Aadhaar. And all these, the, the moment these PAN and Aadhaar are linked, so all your details are financial, uh, the tax authority are able to see at one place. Hmm. So I think note now, maybe over a period of time, you will see that that kind of a transparency probably would be achieved out of these initiatives. Well, thank you very much, Kuldeep, uh, for talking to us here on Law of Money and clarifying lots of issues that concern people as far as their tax is concerned. We'll keep this conversation going. Thank you very much. Thank you.